In this video, we are going to discuss about different types of ports that are available. Some of them are serial port, parallel, USB port, PS2 port, infrared port, Bluetooth port, Firewire port. Let's first start with the serial port. As the name suggests, serial ports transmit data sequentially one bit at a time. They need only one wire to transmit eight bits because they are transmitting only one bit at a time. Because of this, they have very slow speed as well. It is usually a 9 pin or a 25 pin male connector as you can see here. It is also known as COM or communication port or RS323C ports because that is the guideline that these serial ports are following. Let's look at the parallel port. As the name suggests, the parallel port will send 8 bits of data at one time unlike the serial port that was sending one bit at a time. It has 25 pin female pins which you can see here. It is used to connect to printer, scanner, external hard disk drive etc. This is the USB port or the flash drive as we call it. USB stands for universal serial bus. This is the USB drive that you can see here. Industry standard for short distance digital data connection uses this USB guideline. Standardized port to connect a variety of devices like printer, camera, keyboard, speaker, etc. Earlier, all these devices that you can see here listed printer or camera or keyboard or speakers, they were using sequential that is parallel or serial ports. However, with the advent of USB port as they are faster and easier, so USB ports are being used to connect to the external devices. Now let's come to PS2 port. PS2 port stands for personal system 2 port. It was introduced by IBM. At the moment, it is not found in any system except some of the old IBM systems. It is more or less obsolete. It was used to connect to mouse or keyboard. Our IBM system usually had two PS2 ports which was used to connect to these two devices. Infrared port. Infrared port uses infrared rays to connect with devices over a short range, 10 meter. As you can see here, the icon for wireless connection is made here. Two devices that have infrared ports are placed facing each other because if the device that is sending the beam is not received by the receiving device, then the data will not be stored or read or deleted. So that is the infrared port for you. This is the Bluetooth port. Again, Bluetooth port is a wireless connection. It is a telecommunication specification that facilitates wireless connection between phones, computers and other digital devices over short distances similar to the infrared port. It enables synchronization between Bluetooth enabled devices. Two devices that have Bluetooth port can only communicate with each other. If your device is not Bluetooth enabled, you will not be able to send or receive data using Bluetooth port. There are two types of Bluetooth ports, incoming and outgoing. Incoming, as the name suggests, it is used to receive connection from other Bluetooth enabled devices and the outgoing is used to request connection to other Bluetooth enabled devices. Last but not the least, FireWire port. FireWire is Apple computer's own interface standard for enabling high speed connection using serial bus. You could see here that it is using serial bus but still it is having very high speed. That is a proprietary Apple device or port. It is also called the IEEE 1394 standard. It is used mostly for audio and video devices like digital camcorders because they are the ones who need very high speed. So in this video, you have seen how different types of ports can be used to connect to different external devices.